Hi everyone. It's now time for us to put our ice cream cone together. And you'll have your paper that you painted last time. And we're going to be using a few tracers. You're going to have, this is the ice cream scoop tracer and this is the cone tracer. So you'll have a piece of paper to start with the ice cream cone. Now, rather than trace it this way, you want to set it, line it up on that straight edge at the bottom, and then take your pencil and trace right around that tracer. So now you can see you have something to cut out. After you cut it out, it's going to look, well, it doesn't look like that, it looks like this. And then you're going to take an art stick, and you can see I had already done that, but you're going to use diagonal lines to make your waffle cone. And I'm just going to flip that over to show you how I did that. So there you are. Now you're going to have a background paper. Now because I used orange as my ice cream flavor, I'm going to use a blue background because this is orange and blue are complementary colors. That means they look great together. You can't mix these two colors together because that doesn't make a nice color, but they do look good together. So I would start by gluing my cone down. I'll set it there. And then I'm going to take my paper and I'm going to flip it over to the back side. And in each of these sections, I'm going to trace a ice cream scoop. So you're going to have four scoops of ice cream. And let's see. I probably should have traced these ahead of time to save some time, but I didn't. All right, I'm just going to trace my three and then get my big scissors and I'm going to cut them out. So I'm going to first start this way. And, of course, go slowly. And you can see that we traced on the back the white side of the paper because you can see some of my pencil line is still showing. And we don't want that to show in our finished piece. So there's my first scoop, and I'm going to put that scoop there. And then I'm going to move right along to my next one. And my next one is this color here. And I'm going to cut this out. And going slowly, of course, to make a nice, neat scoop. And now when I do my next, I can even glue it down to like an angle, like that. Now I'm going to go on to my next color. So I'm going light, a little bit darker, a little bit darker, and then my darkest one is going to be at the top. But you can reverse it too if you like it better that way. So there's that scoop, and I have one more to do, but I'm not going to do it in my video. Just know that I would be cutting out my last color there to add to my scoop. I can't wait to see your ice cream cones, and that's it.